Welcome back Shoshones, it's Chief Soaring Eagle Superb Man here and it's time for us to continue our civilization. We're at the year 1828 AD, turn 284. Things are going quite well here in uh, Mosin and the rest of the Shoshone realm. Uh, we're still at peace, you know, war has been long gone now at this point. Um, and we're really going for that cultural victory. We got opera houses going in every single one, uh, museums now. Uh, the next one up is uh, Broadcast Tower. We'll be able to get broadcast towers in every single one of these cities after museums. Um, but also we want to uh, go after universities and public schools so we can still maintain that science. Because we don't want any other civilization to get uh, a technological, a technologically advanced military than we do, okay? As long as we can upgrade our naval units, again, because it's an archipelago, we should be okay. But still, it's always good to uh, stay on top of that kind of stuff. Now, we are in the middle of uh, building archaeologists. We already have one that's been built. We have another one coming in Mosin You guys were saying that four or five archaeologists to start would uh, be about right. And then uh, check again what the... Uh, what your situation is, you know, how many more great artists, writers, and um, musicians will you have by that time. So we'll build five of them, we'll see where we are, and then we'll, uh, we'll see, we'll go forward from that after that. And uh, for the wonders, I was asking you guys in the last video, we got the Eiffel Tower coming up, and we got the uh, Broadway coming up. And we want to build that in Mosin Connie right away. Uh, I was asking you guys which one would be more valuable to go after first, and you guys were saying go with the Eiffel Tower. Just because the extra tourism that it provides is already more than all the uh, slots that the Broadway would give you. So go for the Eiffel Tower first, and then pick up the Broadway right after. I agree with that. We'll pick up Eiffel Tower first. Okay? And also in four turns, we are, well, five turns, but in four turns, we want to spend a bunch of our money getting a, a bunch of these allied city-states back on our side so that we can have that vote for the World Congress and get the world religion as superbism. And finally win that religion race that we've been trying with uh, Brazil and the rest of the world for so long now, okay? So, um, yeah, we're not going to... Uh don't have to do anything for right now yet, just go next. We just got to keep on going next here. We're not at war, we got no units on the move. And um, I was, uh, yes, uh, trust me, I know when it comes to the allied city-states. I was reading your comments. Don't, um, uh, should we have, yeah, I want open borders with Poland. Yeah, that's fine. Um, but what, what you guys were saying, uh, don't, uh, oh crap, oh, I lost my train of, uh, my train of thought there. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay, so don't, with the allied city-states, don't buy any of the allied city-states that are already allies of other civilizations that are already going to vote for superbism. Um, that's, it, that's a very good point. So, like, the Portuguese, right, like Cape Town, they're the ally of the Portuguese. There's no point in me trying to make Cape Town my ally because the Portuguese are already going to vote for the, um, the world religion because they're, uh, they're following superbism. So they'll vote and they'll use that allied city-state as the vote as well. So that's good news right there. Well, technically, I mean, it's not for sure because um, they may use some of those votes to ban the luxury resource instead. And uh, porcelain, ooh, that's actually a bad one because I think the porcelain is the, uh, uh, the city-state one, right? Yeah, so that would be all the happiness from the city-states. I got to, uh, might have to, well, whatever, I can't worry about that. Uh, I, got, I want the world, world religion more than the happiness, uh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, look at that, Peregrine, uh, Peregrine Point adopted a religion, so that's good. So Cape Town is now following that, and now it might even spread to uh, Vancouver a little bit more because it's feeling that pressure. Still hasn't spread over here, that's okay. Okay, and uh, Dodo Desert. Oh, look at this, they got somewhat of a, an army coming down here. Remember, the Assyrians, they could attack us again if they want. You guys said to make peace with them. I'm not going to worry. If they take out Dodo Desert, they take out Dodo Desert. Okay, that is a city that I'm willing to give up. Uh, we already have a, a decent enough military here. Gatling gun, a crossbowman, and a castle. So I'm not going to put too much more. And if they get attacked, I mean, this navy... You know what? Hang on. Let me just uh, sort out this navy again. Let me just... Uh, just in case here. All right. This is why I had them down here. Not to just keep them in one place, but just because... In this area, you can get to pretty much anywhere in my empire the fastest. You know, you can get up here through this channel, through that channel, through this channel, down here through this channel. You know, it's, this is a good harbor area. Uh, so let me just move up all these guys. All right. I don't want them messing around with uh, with Dodo uh, with Dodo Desert. If I can send my navy over there to hurt them while they're attacking Dodo Desert, I'll do it. Okay, I'll just I'll send these guys and I'll attack that city right there. I'll do it if they if they attack me. I'm going right after them once again. Okay. It's a lot, that's a lot of units be right there, but that could just be natural units, right? They've had units there for a while. 
And I wouldn't, I don't know. I don't know what to make of that. That could go either way. All right, but I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. Okay, so we got the radio. Yeah, I just want to make sure I don't miss the uh, World Congress. Oh, damn. How are you going to get to this archaeology, at this uh, antiquity site? It's covered by, I don't even know. Whatever. All right, so let's uh, keep an eye on Dodo Desert for the next turn here. Let's see what happens. All right, so Assyria, here's their turn. Let's see if they declare war. Let's see, let's see. No, they did not. Okay, they're just moving units around. We're safe. If they were attacking us, you'd be able to tell. They'd have units all alongside of our borders. Uh, remember, this is a small channel here, so they could just be uh, moving some units through this uh, through this channel type area, right? From like over here through here. So let's not go crazy just yet. I think we're okay. I think we're just fine. Uh, Japan has entered uh, entered the industrial era. That's good for Japan. Okay, up here we got our navy still off the coast, just in case. Warsaw is looking good. Okay, uh, defensive pact. Okay, all my defensive packs have ended, so I have to get that back up and uh, back up and running. So we got radio, which is great. All right, we've entered the modern era now, which is also great. We got a great writer. Okay, so hang on a second here. A lot of stuff has happened. Uh, Mose and Connie. Okay, hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Heron Hall just finished the museum. So what's next in Heron Hall? Let's see. Uh, broadcast tower. It's going to take uh, 15 turns to get that done. Um, I'm going to hold off on that because I want to get uh, going on that science again. Okay, I will get the broadcast tower eventually, but uh, yeah, I do agree that the CN Tower, if we get there, would be useful. And in the meantime, I still need to pick up universities and public schools and observatories. So unless I have a university and a public school and an observatory, I don't necessarily need a stock exchange and a bank. We have enough money, but uh, I want science before I go for the broadcast tower, okay? It does do 33% culture in every city, which will be very, very useful, but um, I want science as well. Remember, I don't want other civs getting ahead of us technologically. Now, what's this? Uh, Kazmir the third, a defensive pact with us has ended. Uh, Kazmir has ended, yeah, so I got to uh, reinstate that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Shaka provided gold. Okay, so that gold per turn, that 50 gold per turn that Shaka was giving us for uh, making peace, that is uh, no longer, uh, that's no longer happening, okay? So we're only making 179 gold per turn now. Uh, oh, we got another spy as well. Okay, so we got another spy. So we're going to send this spy to... I'll send them to another capital, all right? I'll send them to the Assyrian capital of, uh, what's the Assyrian capital? I don't even know. Hang on a second. Uh, Assur, yeah, Assur. I will send, actually, he's already going to vote for me. I don't need to send him there. I'll send him to Morocco. That's why I'll send, uh, he's already in Morocco. I'll send him to uh, the Zulu. No, 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 the Indonesians. Yeah, the Indonesians. They've kind of been a, a quiet civilization down there. Let's figure out what the hell that's going on. Jakarta, I think Jakarta's their, uh, uh, move to Jakarta. There you go. I think Jakarta is their uh, diplomat. We're going to go as diplomats, not spies, okay? Uh, Jakarta, let's see. Yeah, Jakarta is their capital, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, so now. All right, so we have to go up to the next technology. Now, what was I saying about our military, right? I do, we don't need, like, horses. We don't need riflemen. We don't need uh, artillery. But we are going to need, where is it? Here it is. Electronics, and that would give you the battleships. And I think when you pick up the battleships, you'd get the destroyer. Oh, no, combustion for the destroyer. So you still need, you know what, you, need, you would need to pick up all this to get this stuff. Uh, okay, so what I'm going to do is, before I go after these two, I'm going to pick up biology and refrigeration. Because that will pick up the oil resource that you need to get battleships and destroyers. And then we can also pick up refrigeration, which will get those submarines, which is great for subnets. And also the hotel, which is increases... Um, uh, culture and tourism, okay? And then after that, we go straight for the uh, the Navy. Yeah, we got to pick this up first, though, okay? So that's what I'm talking about. We do need to focus back on science so we can pick up all these uh, techs quite quickly. Now, we got the uh, archaeologist done in Mosin So we're going to go after the Eiffel Tower. 13 turns. It's going to take some time. Now, I was reading your comments. Somebody was saying, why don't you get a uh, great engineer for a 1,000 faith and uh, quickly purchase it? You know, that's not a bad idea, but the only thing is I... I gotta be careful because I want to save up that faith for uh, for the end when I need um, that tourism victory, when I need all those uh, 
those uh, musicians and such, right? So I'm, I'm going to pass on that for now because I think we have a great engineer on his way soon anyways. Hang on, let's see, great person list. Great engineers, yeah, we got one coming in six turns. So I can build the, uh, the Eiffel Tower legit and then I'll use the engineer to build Broadway right after it, okay? I, I don't wanna spend our faith. Our faith is gonna be our, uh, our saving grace at the end of the game. You guys will see why I wanted all that faith earlier on. Remember, when we started all those religious buildings, we're still making the 85 faith per turn. That's what we're doing. That's why I wanted that faith, okay? We're still very religious. Now, archaeologists. This guy's already been sent up there, the other guy. So I'm going to send this one over here as well. Yeah, you can snag up that one. All right, so we're already getting that one and that one. Uh, privateer, uh, you stay put. You stay put. Yeah, you guys can all stay put, actually. Let me just uh, actually fortify. Fortify, fortify. There you go. Fortify, fortify. Fortify, fortify. Uh, you, we're going to create a great work of art. There you go. We got another great uh, artist, I believe. Great writer. Great writer. Uh, frigate, fortify. Okay. Three more turns for the uh, World Congress, so I don't need to build anything just yet. What's going over in Dodo -Do Desert? What the hell are they building? What is that? A workboat? Why am I building a workboat in Dodo Desert? I click on workboat? Uh, I must have. Alright, well, it's only going to be two turns, so finish up the workboat. I guess. I don't remember clicking on work. I must have. I must have. The game's not, <laughs> it's not trying to screw me over or anything. Um, yeah, we're good. I'm just trying to think, did I miss anything here? I got, there's something on the tip of my, on the tip of my tongue, on the edge of my mind. I'm thinking I forgot something here. Was I supposed to look at something? Oh, defensive pack for, yeah, yeah, that was, I, I knew it. I knew I forgot something. Defensive pact with Poland. There you go. Propose. Very well. Good. So we got the defensive pact again. And joint declaration of friendship. Good. So we're friends again with Poland. And we got the defensive pact again. Japan, we should still have the same thing. Defensive pact. And uh, yeah, we're still friends. Okay. Got to make... I got to protect these two guys. Because they protect us as well from the uh, the Zulu. The Zulu aren't going to try anything against us three. There's no way in hell. Uh, Brazilians are still following our religion. Good. Salvador. Are these switched yet? Damn. Still taking a while to switch. Whatever. Alright, we'll go next turn. Fly through this. I want to get the World Congress done in this video. We should be able to get it done. And then get World Religion, and then I think we'll end it so that you guys can uh, see what we can propose next for the next World Congress. I'm thinking something like World Fair or something like that. What's going on here? Oh, the Zulus are attacking the, uh, the uh, Indonesians, right? The Zulu and the Indonesians are still at war. Okay, that doesn't affect us. Don't worry. If they're bringing a navy down to Mosin I dare them to bring a navy to Mosin The only thing that's dangerous against Mosin is the Portuguese. If they manage to, uh, like, munger up some crumunger, yeah, that's a word, uh, but uh, get a huge ass uh, ground uh, military and just, you know, wave after wave after wave, that's not going to happen. There's no way a navy takes out Mosin No way. It can only be attacked from the, uh, the ocean by one tile. There's no way, okay? Uh,. Sidian has declared war on uh, Indonesia, probably because they're allies with the Zulu now. Uh, yep, blah, blah, blah. Uh, yep, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to spend my money. We're going to spend the money the next turn, okay? So again, look around, just see if there's anything out of the ordinary going on. Any uh, units alongside of our borders? Don't worry about uh, the, down there. They're not going to do anything. Our workers are still unautomated. They're going around. Oh, excuse me. Uh... We got a harbor coming in Peregrine Point. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I think we're good still. So we can go one more turn. And let's just see what happens here. Now, that other spy that I got, there's no way. Yeah, if he was available, then that would be real good. But we can't. We can't do that. But now we're going to have to figure out how many votes we can get. If I don't get the world religion this time, man, I'm going to be pissed. Uh... Oh, what the hell? I thought I might let you know that I've launched an invasion... What? I've launched an invasion of one of your little pet states. The lands of Colombo will make a fine addition to my own. Oh my god. He attacked one of my city-states, Colombo. Uh, you will pay for this in time very well. I won't let this uh, create a divide between us. And I lose 20, uh, 20 influence. You know what? You will pay for this in time. He's attacked Colombo. He's going after city-states now. This guy's a crazy maniac. Where's Colombo? Where's Colombo? Colombo's down here. Why are you attacking Colombo for? You're not going to get there. Whatever. Let him attack Colombo. Maybe he was, uh, you know what, he's probably, um, just giving me that message because they just got allied by the Indonesians or something, so that they went to war, but they were still allied with me, you know, they probably just had a little glitch there. Yeah, yeah, because they're not my allies anymore, I think they've been bought out by the Indonesians, watch, Colombo, let's see, Colombo, yeah, Indonesians, 43. Okay, so, workboat, you're gonna get up there. Alright, very nice, work yourself, so one turn left, so this is the turn we spend our money. So hang on, before I do that, 
Uh, Dodo Desert. What should we get going in Dodo Desert? Uh, uh, yeah, we'll get, uh, yeah, university and all that stuff done. Choose production. Okay, so we got the harbor done in Peregrine Points. Public school, yeah, we're not getting up the, uh, the broadcast towers yet. I want science right now. We have enough, we're making enough culture right now. We're at 10, so we're at a social policy every 10 turns. That's more than enough right now. We'll get the broadcast towers eventually. Right now, it's going to be universities, okay? There you go. Uh, yep. This thing is still going to get done in 12 turns. Okay, so now World Congress time. Let's see how many votes we got going around the world. So we got two votes from uh, the uh, Moroccans. We're going to uh, vote. They're also voting a nay for uh, that. That's okay. What about you? You are voting. They are voting yay for superbism, so that's good. But I already have two of their votes, so they might get another third towards uh, that. Uh, now, what other civilizations? Japan, what are they going to vote for? We don't know. That kind of sucks. Because they're not following our religion. So probably, yeah, they're technically not. Now the Polish, they should vote for us technically, right? So I don't need to, uh, well, they don't have any allied city-states anyways. So you know what? Let's just go through the allied city-states and see which ones I absolutely need. Now what? Who the hell is, who, no allied nobody? I must be tied with someone. That's what it is. I need another two to become their ally. Okay, so I'll do that for them. Yeah, gift a, you know what? I'll gift a unit to them. Yeah, gift a unit. It'll give me five influence. Yeah, gift a unit. There you go. I'll give them. Uh, I'll give them a. Uh, you know what? I'll give them. A, yeah, I'll give them one of my privateers over here. I, I have two privateers. That's more than enough. There you go. All right. Ur gets a privateer. Boom. All right. So now Ur. They not go up. They not give me a. Uh, hang on. This is this is that's weird. That doesn't show it. Still, it still says two. Maybe you have to uh, wait a turn or something like that for it to go through. Um, okay. So before I do that one, let me just go through the rest. Okay. So. Uh, the Portuguese, they should be voting for us, correct? If I'm right, it won't tell me. Yeah, it won't tell me. Um, yeah, they should be voting for us because they are following... Their uh, capital city is... Yeah, okay, so that's what I'll go off. I'll go off a capital city. Now, Morocco, that's up by 43. Morocco is not going to vote for us, correct? We have a diplomat in there, so hang on, I can check it out. Hang on. World Congress, sorry, I'm, just, I'm getting used to these screens still. Uh, nay for world religion, but they are voting for us. Uh, they are giving us two. So, I think I should take those other two away from them. Two from the city-states, yeah. So, I'm going to take that city-state, which is 43. I can easily get that for, uh, ooh, oh, damn. It costs a thousand to get that one? Jesus. All right, well, I'll come back to that one. Hang on. Uh, Shoshone, Indonesians. All right, so Merchantile, 43 for this one as well. Man, what does everyone have, 43? Uh, gift. Damn, man. A thousand for that one, a thousand for that one. Now, Brazil, you guys were saying that. Do not worry about Brazil. They're already going to vote for you. Okay, so that's good. Uh, Zulu, Sidian, how much is this up by? That's up by 84, so that's going to take a while to get that one. So I'm going to skip on that one. And then this one, 132, Jesus. Uh, that's one they're going to take like 5,000 as well. Okay, so we'll start off with these top ones then. Uh, you. Can't give anything to you. You're already going to vote for us. You, 43. Okay, so give the gift, 43. I could give him 45 and save 250. Yeah, that's what I'll do. So 500, there you go, and 250. Okay, so now they're allies with us. So there's one ally. So vote for us, vote for us, vote for us. Indonesian, they're up by 43. So the same thing, again, a 30 and a 15. There you go, give the gift and give a gift. All right, so there's our ally again. Okay. Uh, very nice. Now, how many votes do we have now? We got nine votes. We're going to need more. So, nine, eleven, and, uh, thirteen. Last time, we had fourteen and we lost. I think we needed, like, sixteen to win. So, we need to get, like, sixteen votes. We still have three thousand left. Uh, so I need to get a few more votes. This could be close, man. I don't know if we're going to get it, actually. Uh, yeah, you and you. Okay, so you know what? I'll definitely, I'll, I have to take this one. This one's an obvious one. So I'm going to give them 250. All right, there you go. Now they're allies with us. I just, I had to do it just to make sure. So that's a vote. 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 Now three more. So hang on. Oh no, Brazil's going to vote for us, right? Yeah, Brazil's going to vote for us, you guys said. So these two, so 84 and 132. So the 84's got to go first. Pledge to protect uh, 84. So a thousand, yep. Yeah. And then how much more? 19, so I'll give him a 30, yeah, there you go, all right, we still have 2,000 left here, we might be able to do something here, okay, so there you go, so the, uh, the Portuguese are going to vote for us, the Brazilians are going to vote for us, and the only thing about the Brazilians is they could still use that vote to vote nay on porcelain, right, and it's only 29, now hang on, I think I might want to take that from Brazil, boys, 
I know that may sound dumb, but if they use their votes on the other thing, then it might as well be wasted, right? So hang on. Uh, if I give them a thousand for sixty-five, how much do I need? I have to give them two thousand. Okay, so I can't. Vancouver cannot get on my side. Okay, so I'm not going to spend it on Vancouver. So I might as well spend it here, just to be certain, just to grab those extra. So here you go, five hundred. All right, they're allies with us. And then this one is eighty-two. How much can I give this? Uh, no, I can't get that one. Well, I might be able to get that one, but you know what? I'm not. I'm not going to do it. No, I'm not going to do it. Oh, I got a second. Oh, sorry about that. I just had to blow my nose. Okay, so uh, with Cape Town, you know, we can't get this one either. I, like, we technically we could, I guess. No, we couldn't actually. It would be it would be really stretching. So we're gonna leave it right there. Okay. So World Congress, we got 12 votes technically. Then we got another two votes here, so that's 14. Another two votes here, that's 16. And then hopefully these this guy and. Um, the Portuguese, hopefully they put some of those votes towards the world religion and not towards banning the uh, luxury resource, okay? So, um, we'll see. That's the, mo that's the most I can put into it. If we can't get it right now, we're not, we're not going to get this world religion. It's just not going to happen, okay? So, uh, let's see what happens. Yep, let's see what happens here. Now, hopefully no other uh, civilization buy up these city-states. I mean... Technically, I don't know how it works. I don't know if uh, in your last turn, if the World Congress starts right after your last turn, or if all the uh, uh, other civilizations actually have a chance. Um, it would suck if they do, but we'll see what happens, okay? So, Mose and Connie, the uh, World Congress of Mose and Connie is about to be reestablished, okay? It's come to my attention that you're getting a little too friendly. Okay, get over it. Yeah, yeah, these guys don't like that I, uh, I allied up their uh, city-states, but what are you going to do? That's why I'm saving up all that gold. Uh, yeah, okay, sorry, Poland, uh, we're sorry this has caused a divide between us, but what are you gonna do about it? Okay, so come on, nobody, nobody, I don't think it's switched, uh, no, Shock has, yeah, has made peace, that's good, uh, okay, uh, we're sorry this caused a divide between us, okay, uh, Zulu, Coop, oh, Zulu, Coop, and Sidian failed, good, the Zulus, uh, attempted one of those things that, uh, Pugwini's doing, but it failed, so that's good. Um, made peace with Colombo, good. So I haven't seen anybody take a, another city-state from me yet, which is good news. Processing turns to the city-state, so it might be over. Hang on, oh, no, no, that's okay. Tire cancels the quest. We're still okay. Come on, nobody steal. Oh, barbarians, we should be good. I think we have all of them. I think we had all the city-states here. Okay, so, uh, let's see this. Shaka has made peace with Colombo, okay. Uh, Zulu's attempted, a, uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Uh, blah, blah. Blah, okay, blah, 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 Peregrine Point, okay, and what's this? Uh, okay, so, I guess it's going to do the, uh, the vote the next turn, so I gotta do one more turn, but I gotta vote for the, oh no, I gotta vote, right, okay, I haven't put the votes ahead yet, okay, so here we go, uh, so here we go, I'm gonna vote all my delegates towards the superbism. Okay, so there you go. So hopefully that it's going to get 16 votes at least. And last time, if we had 16, that should have won. So if the Portuguese can just and the Brazilians could just put a few more, get me to 18 votes, you know, it's guaranteed. It's damn well guaranteed. So 12 delegates towards, yeah. Here it goes. Commit delegates. Boom. There you go. All right. Unit needs order. So we'll do one more turn, actually. Uh, where did you come from? It doesn't really matter where you go now. Hang on, let me just figure out where you went. Where's his previous route? Uh, Sao Paulo. There you go. Go there again. Okay, and last turn. Let's see what happens. Now, it doesn't matter if the other uh, civilizations uh, re-ally with those city-states because now the delegates are already in. They're already in there, okay? We're good. We are good to go. And uh, this is definitely going to be our last turn, so you guys can uh, help us uh, help out the Shoshone with what should be uh, proposed in the next World Congress. I'm thinking something that helps out our culture. Or our tourism. I'll show you guys which ones. It's like the World Fair or something like that. And we have so many cities that we can really focus on it. So uh, it'll be... It's not automatic, but uh, it might as well be. <sighs> I won't have to build it in Mosin. You guys will see it. Once, once we get there, we'll get to it. So uh, processing turns for the barbarians. Alright, that's good news. I saw it. So hang on. Uh, production for Eagle Islands. We'll go after the broadcast tower now because we got the uh, public school done. Alright, so... We gotta make a proposal for the next one, right? So, uh, you guys can, uh, uh, stand up on this one, I guess. 
Uh, I'm thinking the World Fair, right? Basically, if we get first place for the World Fair, we have to, uh, we would get uh, culture increases by 100% for 20 turns. 100% for 20 turns, we'd be making 800 and something culture, almost 900 culture per turn, okay? That would really help us out. So, I'm thinking the World Fair, but you guys can uh, weigh in on that. Okay, so take away that. Uh, Enact World Religion Superbism was passed. The effects are now active. 12 yeah from Shoshone, tw uh, 2 yeah from Morocco, 2 yeah from Poland, 2 yeah from Brazil, 1 yeah from Assyria, 1 yeah from Portugal, and then the nays from Japan, Zulu, Morocco, and Indo Indonesia. Okay, so there you go. Our tourism now has uh, been spiked, I guess. And, uh, oh, it was passed. Oh, my God. Luxury, a luxury resource porcelain was passed. Okay, so, well, well, what are you going to do? Okay, so our tourism now is a lot better. I think it's because, uh, yeah, uh, is it 25% or 50? Yeah, 50% 50 bonus from being a holy city, a world religion. Okay, so now we have world religion is superbism. From day one, we were trying to get that religion spread, and now it will officially. So we're going to end it right here. We uh, we got world religion. Our tourism is going to spike now. Now we really need to focus on that tourism, okay? So uh, you guys can let me know about the next, uh, what's it called? Um... Uh, resolution, I'll just uh, highlight all these for you guys so you guys can read them. I'm not going to go through them all. All right, there you go. You guys can pause it and read it if you see them all. There you go, historic landmarks, okay. Or we could uh, get rid of one of these ones. Well, that's uh, I mean, we could uh, get rid of the uh, no happiness from porcelain, but we're still making plenty of happiness, so it's not a problem for us. Okay, and last but not least, I'll show you guys the demographics. There you go, literacy, we're in uh, second, but we're only one percentage behind. We're fine, okay, approval rating first. We're up there, boys, we are up there. So we just got to keep on trying, uh, hacking away at that cultural victory, but now the planet is following superbism. From day one, this is what we wanted, and finally the goal was reached.